this is going to liven up our palate, considering what's to follow. That's true. We do have something big that's coming up in just a little bit. Yes. But for this podcast, we're going a little on the sweeter side. Oh, that's true. And we're going for a little bit of local flavor. Well, maybe not local to us. No, not local to us. <laughs> local to people in these regions yes. that enjoy these beverages. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, some, we're going to have some cane sugar sodas made by a very large corporation. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> that is uh, bringing back some uh, historical flavors. I think that's kind of what they're promoting. But we're going to see how it goes for this Give It a Shot. <laughs> I'm Andrew. And I'm Keith. And we are AboutBeverages.com. And the beverages, actually, that we're about today uh, are, well, they're from Coca-Cola. This is their local flavor uh, line. And we're going to be trying the uh, Georgia Peach and the California Raspberry. Now, we were talking a little bit earlier during the live show, which uh, if you ever want to catch us for that, most Thursday nights at 6.30. We are on. Pacific. Yeah. On twitch.tv slash about beverages. Um, We were chatting a little bit about Georgia Peach. That makes sense. I've heard that before. California Raspberry. That one was a little more of a leap for me, but not for you. No, not necessarily when you think about all the berries that come out of California. Right. Um, that's And even like we think of Knott's Berry Farm, which got their beginning with the poison actually, berries and the rat and all the different preserves and things that... I hadn't thought of that. Yeah. Wow, so. that's amazing. See, to me, the first thing that hit me was when I think California, <laughs> due to the marketing and the heavy uh, handedness of this, I think avocado. <laughs> and I'm glad I they didn't. Don't, <laughs> Do you have a graphic for that? No, I don't. <laughs> I think California we avocado, come Coca-Cola, <laughs> not so good. But you don't know. <laughs> There's a picture of us uh, well, I'm holding a, a bottle of Coke and an avocado. When these two things come together. <laughs> you could use the pit in the avocado to pop the cap off, too. Yeah, Maybe. I don't know. It might work. Uh, but if not, uh, they unfortunately have given us the California raspberry. So we'll find Correct. out. I, that sounds, from a flavor perspective, a much better choice. So <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> good, good on you, Coca Cola. Yeah. Uh, so anyway, we're going to try both of these. What's decided, that? It was in contention, but they decided yeah, not to. So close. Nah, nah, nah. Uh, these are both uh, cane sugar based, so they're going uh, for that. You can find uh, Coca Cola with the you know cane sugar. Uh, at least here in Southern Arizona, you can find. It. I don't know if that's right. across the country, but you can find it in bottles. Usually, a little more expensive, um, but uh, but it can be found. So it's it's. I think that was another reason why I picked this up. And two very unique flavors, which, like I said, I'm after Dr. Pepper. Probably Coke is my favorite, like cola. I, I do say. like the Dr. Pepper. I, yeah, I, I just don't drink much soda anymore, though. Overall, yeah. But I do every once in a while, though. It just it it does hit the spot. Yeah, <laughs> I notice when we have our get-togethers. That's when you usually hit the soda. I it's, 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 like, it's I when I get palate fatigue. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know if it was that or if it was like. I'm at a party. It's my guilty pleasure. <laughs> you no. just see Keith in the corner of the can in a straw. <laughs> no, it's usually like oh, okay. I can't. I can't do another beer right now or whatever. It's no. I I need something that's not alcohol. Okay. And then yeah, and then use but that's nice. So you get the nice bubbles and it's you know lively, and refreshing, and a little caffeine maybe to rejuvenate you. There you go. Yes. <laughs> caffeine so. rejuvenation. That's right. Uh, well, it is going to be difficult to uh, have both of these sodas from this uh, just picture that I have here. So we need the bottles. That's true. I don't see them at the moment. Well, I he felt worried. slighted last week because we didn't give him the coffee. Or did we give him the coffee? I don't think we did. Oh, oh, oh. That's all right. He's got one. He's got one. It looks like he's got California raspberry. That's his choice, apparently. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, just the other one. There's only so much that we're using practical effects here, folks. As a, yeah. Uh, and there's the Georgia peach. Look, you switched them around. There we so, go. So he could get eyeline on both of them. Right. Yeah. This is Phil Collins from the Hello, I Must Be Going album. That's right. He uh, always likes to check out what beverage we are having. That is kind of a, a running thing. His watchful eye. <laughs> yeah. And he, and apparently his choice is the raspberry. So we'll see which one winds up tasting better. So let's, uh, let's go sure. ahead and grab both of those from a Mr. Phil Collins there. And uh, we've got a bunch of uh, rocks glasses here on the table, nothing special. And uh, we're going to do this a little bit more more relaxed than we do some of our other things because I, I don't... We're not going to necessarily talk about the color. Color, we don't... Yeah, as I'm opening, <laughs> if you want to mention, like I said, I can go ahead and I'll crack these open yeah. if you want to talk about it. It appears the color to be the Coke. color of cola. Coca-Cola. <laughs> yeah, brown. which we always used to say, what, like iced tea kind of color? Yeah. Nice brown. Ooh. Some lively carbonation. I would hope so. 
That would suck if it, yeah. Fortnite was flat. It was flat. That would, that's that. So not starting out well, Coca-Cola. That's my new uh, alt wave band. <laughs> flat. Lively carbonation. Lively carbonation. Keep feeling lively carbonation. That sounds like something Pert Happily would say. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I'm Troy McClure, and you may know me from such <laughs> California oh, raspberries as. I got old Troy McClure. I like these wide glasses. I feel a little more confident pouring over the electronics. Over, yeah, over. <laughs> All right. So, uh, what do you think we should start with? Whichever one's on the left. Perfect. Georgia Peach. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> that's peachy. That's definitely peachy. Oh, my God. That's great. All right. Yeah, that smells good. Okay. Yeah, Jordan, it actually it, smells like real peach. Yeah, it actually does. It smells like a fresh peach. It's not yeah. like a. Fa- I was ready for kind of like fake, like you know, I wasn't peach sure, ex- but yeah. like not extract, but like peach syrup or something wow. like that. But that actually smells like a re- like it smells like a fresh peach. And then after that, I get total Coca Cola yeah, aroma. But they got that down. That was good. All right, let's go. I like it. <laughs> to be honest, it's quite good. <laughs> that's really good. <laughs> oh my god, that's actually quite delicious. Yeah, that's that's really tasty. Wow, that is that is actually really good. <laughs> wow, I did not expect that. <laughs> <laughs> how much? How much was this? Do you I remember? No, okay. I think they were I actually they were on know. sale. I want to say they were a dollar or a dollar and a half a piece. Okay, because I think they were I think they were on sale two for three. I got them at my local fries store. Um, they had, they've got a, like a big like, kind of specialty soda area, which initially I was looking, uh, cause we had that bourbon barrel aged cola one time that was okay. Um, that was like their mm. brand or something. And then also next to that, I saw these and I was like, oh, okay. I'm like, all right, I'll try one of each of these. Well, Coca-Cola originated in Georgia, right? So they should know some things about peach. Although it's probably not necessarily made in Georgia anymore. They do. I don't know, but that's really good. That is really good. I would, I would buy one of these again. Yeah. All right. That was quite tasty. All right. So how do you think California raspberry is going to happen? Though? I don't know, bro. Well, it's got a lot to live up to. It's got okay. some big shoes to fill. Okay, I mean it's there. I, it's pretty. I think it's, it's a fairly strong aromatic. This one is a little bit more toward like a candied raspberry. I was gonna say like syrup, more syrupy. Yeah. Um, it makes me. This just makes me think of delicious, refreshing beverage. This yeah. aroma makes me think of dessert for some reason. Yeah, I would agree with just that. Just because yeah. of the, the more yeah, definitely more the. Of, yeah, definitely more raspberry initially comes through with that, like, and like a, like a candied raspberry kind of thing. Like, it's a much more sweet, like almost like a Hickory Farms can I know those are strawberry, but like, it's that kind of like candied kind of yes. uh, aroma. And then the cola yeah. is is after that. Yep. So, all right, well, let's see what, what happens in the flavor. The raspberry lends itself more to the cola taste, I think. So, you get more cola, it's like more of a blend. Mm hmm. The cola comes in faster. Um, it's not bad. I, I like the peach a ton more. I agree, but this isn't bad. This one is like uh, it's. I mean, it's it's almost it's hitting some of the like if you have a cherry cola or cherry coke kind of note, obviously because it's the raspberry. Um, so it's hitting some of those kind of flavors, but it's it's a little more the Georgia peach really tasted like a blend of the two. Like the two things were very harmoniously came together. You got a little, you know, oh, I get a little peach and then I get the, right. you know, kind of was a nice uh, melding of those two flavors. Whereas this to me is like, ooh, raspberry and then cola. Yeah. Like, I don't know. It does. There's a little bit of a blending in there, but it's not near as, uh, as, as good. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's I wouldn't turn this down. I think that I think no. it, cause I don't think it tastes like super fake in any way. I think that no. did a good job there. But like I said, yeah, if you, if you said which one of these you want, I'd take the peach like all day and I will actually buy another couple of those. It could just be the way Coke and raspberry flavor kind of go together or maybe what it triggers in your mind. But, but yes, I agree that that's more, like I said, it's dessert like, yeah. Um, whereas this is just the, the peach is just amazing. Did you go back to the peach already? I will. Yeah, that's just, really and it's good. not this, the raspberry seems sweeter to me. I would agree. Although I'm, sh- I'm sure they both have, well, maybe they have the same sugar content. So, uh, but it's just, I think it's just because of raspberries being a, 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 f- a just a fruit that the way it, it blends with the, the cola taste. But, all right. Oh, there's Georgia, no sugar. No, Georgia peach. Yeah. Georgia peach has uh, 37 grams and uh, the California raspberry has a 37, 37 grams. grams. Okay. Yeah. So same amount. But I think it's just the just way the that natural flavoring the, can bring the out The type more. of that yeah, fruit. For sure. Uh, but yeah, but both, they're both good, but that peach is, that's delicious. And actually 37 grams for a 12 ounce bottle. Are little, you sure little, they're not saying there's four servings in here? 
No, I see it says one serving per container. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah, oh, that would be bad. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, like I think it, uh, you know, that compared to other, like that's a little bit less. Like it seems like usually Sometimes it's like 40, 40. I was just going to say yeah. 40 to 43 is yeah. kind of usually what I see for regular soda things. But wow, that is, I am really glad I bought those. Yeah, that's <laughs> quite tasty. That was a good choice. I, again, I, that was one of those things where I was like, oh, it's probably be a little gimmicky, but it'd be fun to, you know, try something else because we do uh, at About Beverages, we do so many things that are usually alcohol based in some form yeah. or another we did do coffee last week uh which is uh, where we all where we started so that's definitely something that's always near and dear to our hearts but uh but yeah like i said i'm always glad to mix it up with some of these other things and yeah i would i will buy some of these the georgia peach again i think that was that was uh, quite tasty yeah that's that was a good one that was a winner that was a winner winner chicken dinner also what could be a winner for you if you like content that involves beverages <laughs> there's a place you can go you yes it's you know we don't have the website thing on there anymore but that's okay no. uh you can go to uh, aboutbeverages.com we're one of those dot coms there's not many of those left you got to make sure you get in on those like there's before dot, they're all gone there's dot nets there's dot tvs there's dot org there's dot all the, dot com is really still where it's at and we have one of those uh so if you want to head to the website you can find uh, not only content that is uh, soda related but also all the different other types of beverages that we do and uh the other thing we've got many things to promote so here's why grocery list things youtube also where we're at if you just want to subscribe there want to find out when our newest videos go live want to, don't want to have to keep checking a website and all that kind of stuff want it just to come right to your door that is the place to go for video content. If you only want audio because the two of us, a little too much to look at, I get it. Totally get it. You uh, can do that. You can do that. Where can you go for just audio content? Uh, iTunes. Excellent. Yes. iTunes is the place. Uh, and if you're into any of the social media things, which most people are today, especially the kids, the kids are into the social medias, <laughs> um, you can uh, find us, of course, on Twitter, Instagram, untapped which hopefully the kids are not in untapped. Right. We'll leave that one out from the kids part. And you won't find the soda on untapped, but no, you would not. But some of our other things, Absolutely. all of those just search for about beverages and you can find us there. Uh, I think that's it. Is that everything? Did you mention Twitch? I think we did. <gasps> I did earlier, I but we should mention again, okay. twitch.tv slash about beverages for our live show. Every thir most Thursdays, most Thursdays, most Thursdays at six thirty Pacific right now, daylight time. Yeah, it's it's light. It is one of those kind of things. But as we always say, whether we like it or not, you should give it a shot. <laughs>